I'm gonna try and cut these uh, pineapples straight in half. Whoa! Dude. Just a hole, that's it. Oh. Hello and welcome to Dope or Nope, the channel in which we rate products or we wear the underwear on the outside of our body. Whoa, don't we always wear it on the outside of our body? Not if you eat it. Ooh. <laughs> Today we're, <laughs> we are joined by Gunner. Yes. From Wrecked. If you're not familiar with Wrecked, Wrecked is a channel all about danger and destruction. Like and all, this. All the crazy things you shouldn't do. <laughs> we do cooler stuff than that. Cooler stuff than yeah. that. Yeah, that's why Tanner's not on Wrecked anymore. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 so also just want to let you know, before we get into this video, there's another video over on Rex's channel, so at the end of this video, go check that out, because we'll be over there. Do it. So make sure you grab a friend, grab a family member, and have some laughs and share some laughs together as we rate products. Today, we are looking at, oh no, actually, we're looking at an unbox, we're, we're unboxing a mystery apocalyptic crate. Each of these items, uh, we're gonna be doing a series of tests. Michael, you set up these tests for us? Yes, the whole Dope and Up team did. So Noah did with Dave and Chanel and Liz. We'll be doing the test in the Rex set. And we're gonna see how well each item works in the event of the apocalypse what's an apocalypse the end of the world occasionally zombies bring out the crate it's just wood holy cow this is no joke what what do you hear that's mahogany no it's mahogany. Try again. all right here you go guys <laughs> wow cold steel there's some weapons in here we don't want to show them everything close it a little okay, bit okay okay we're gonna move this off and we're gonna take one by one all right i'm gonna pick i'm gonna pick for what i think is possibly the most effective weapon in the apocalypse oh still wrapped yes keeps it safe from the zombie gore whoa this is heavy but this feels plastic though oh it's unbreakable it literally says unbreakable baseball bat all right that's the challenge no that's gonna hurt you ever tried it well you both have <laughs> yeah. immediately talked to two baseball players <laughs> just like hit like a metal pole and <laughs> you know yeah. like vibrates all through your brain <laughs> that's a metal bat this won't do that to that extent here hold it again no i just feel like you look really weird holding a baseball bat can you <laughs> Yeah, you do. No, because I'm pretending to be a Jedi. <laughs> <laughs> that explains it because you're holding it backwards. There it is. That makes more sense. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try it out, baby. All right, so I got the bat here, and I'm supposed to get inside of this thing. It's kind of a pretty chest. But I kind of want to take it home, you know? It's a bosom. It's a yeah. bosom. <laughs> That's not the way you use that word. All right, stand behind the protector. You ready, Dave? Yep, let's do this. Oh! I didn't even go, like, full strength. <laughs> Finger. Oh, Twix, too much chocolate. I get an extra life! <laughs> yeah, I like, oh! Hey, wait, watch out. Oh my gosh, you almost hit me. Okay, so what do you guys That's think? That that destroyed it pretty well, and that didn't. Oh wait, no, just the sticker got damaged. <laughs> this is pretty durable, man. Yeah, pretty durable. It is wood. See? Oh no, wait, that's the wood from this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best product yet. So I rated it dope. Cause I got I rate... candy after, and it worked. I, I like rate these are dope. All right, Tan Man, your turn. All right, it's my turn. I'm gonna go take a pick. Yo, unbox it over here, dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right, tan man who ain't so tan, what you got for me? I got us a tire thumper. Wow, thump, thump, a dump. Also known as a spiked bat. So I'm gonna search the word thump. Hey Siri, what does thump mean? Hit heavily, especially <laughs> with the fist or blunt implement. So yeah, you wow, instantly did damage to the table. I know this is a spiked bat. Some people know this is a tire thumper with spikes. A spiked tire thumper, one could say. I guess when you hit a tire with this, <laughs> Does it thump? Yeah, you're checking the air pressure of your enemy's tire. <laughs> <laughs> I have a big issue with this weapon though. Is like, are zombies gonna be driving cars? No, thump you hit it? zombies with it. You don't hit their tires. <laughs> that was just a joke. <laughs> are you thinking you're popping zombie tires? There's some zombie mom going to Walmart. <laughs> Why is it called a tire thumper if it's in the apocalyptic box? Because you put spikes on it. It can also be used to like break down shelters, bases to help get you like scrap materials to like build. Are you playing Fortnite in the apocalypse? Yeah, those are pickaxes. <laughs> I want to test this first. I'll give it a couple swings. Maybe I'll let you try. We just trust you. Have. I could totally drop this on your hand or something right now. Stop. <laughs> oh, it hard. is sharp. Yeah, it's it a little is sharp. sharp. Oh, I'm bleeding. bleeding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's do it. Give me my tire thumper. That's not a tire. It's a thumper. So you cannot enter in this. You know what? It's a tax season. And guess what they're having back there? All my write-offs. I have to go get those. Or else, guess what? You're you a less relatable joke. <laughs> <laughs> All these kids are like, what's a tax? What is a write-off? <laughs> Guys, I'm a measly old gardener. Behind this. <laughs> 
wall. Mean. I'm a measly old gardener. And I got measles. And behind here, I know there's high chews. That's That's not hey. I like my gardener. My, gar my gardener's dope. Hey, you can... He's like the nicest guy I ever met. Can he do this? I can do anything. Whoa, that actually did something. Gunner's not impressed. I'm not impressed. Oh, hi, Jews! Hey, okay, get one. Write that up. Are you done? Are yeah, I'm done. done. Guess who gets his high chews? Oh, there's high chews inside it? Yeah. How'd they do that? <laughs> we'll have Liz put them behind it. <laughs> that was my goal. I was like, how'd they put it in the door? <laughs> Dope! I would say that would work. I'm gonna say nope. It took way too many hits. I suck in the nope. That's a door, not a person. That would totally destroy a person in one hit. All right, let's see. What you got? What you got for me, dog? I don't know. Better pick something good. You like how dressed up you got for this? Yeah, look at us. We look like <laughs> homeless people. <laughs> you guys all went for blunt weapons, and I chose a tomahawk. Why'd you choose a tomahawk? I chose a tomahawk because. Why'd you choose a tomahawk? Why did I chose a tomahawk? Why'd you choose? A t why'd you? Why'd you chose a tomahawk? Why did you choose a tomahawk? I like throwing weapons. Oh gosh, that makes me so paranoid. Huh? That makes me so paranoid. Huh? That pakes me so marinoid. That I understood. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what, what do you what do you think this is gonna do to uh, like a melon? It's got a lot of cutting power, so I think I can destroy it. In one hit? Like a head? But then also I wanna throw it at someone. Wanna Does anyone it. wanna be my target? Um, uh, maybe I can find some volunteers. I kinda wanna see if you can more like, you know, Gordon Ramsay it. Fillet? <laughs> yeah, just fillet this watermelon. Like, where's the lamb sauce? <laughs> just cutting up in the watermelon. Where's the lamb sauce? <laughs> watermelon? <laughs> Alright, let's go use it. For this item, we're gonna be trying to make the most appetizing meal we can with this tomahawk and those coconuts. So Honestly, why do coconuts always look so sad? Why do they look like bowling balls? They're just always like... Alright, let's get behind here while Gunner makes a fool of himself. Alright, right, 45 seconds. Ready? 45 seconds? Yeah, to make the best uh, meal. Oh, wait. Don't do your fingers. Yeah. Whoa! What are we going to do? There we go. Look at that. <laughs> I'm trying to make it look Don't good. Hold it while you're doing it. Look at that, beautiful! All right, 45 seconds. Ready? Ready? Go! Oh, oh missed! Oh! Wow, yours looks rotten. Come on. Ah, oh, dang it, I broke it. Yeah, mine does look a little rotten. Ooh. Oh, it stinks. <laughs> it stinks so bad. Yeah, I agree, dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right! I lose that one. I will say, I'm going for more of the uh, five-star restaurant. Five Imagine you're having a beautiful night in Hawaii. I'd rather have five guys. <laughs> I would actually, too. Here we go. All right, ready? Go! Trick is to clear the plate. <laughs> Trying to stick it in the wood. Why isn't it working, dude? You're totally missing! I am on purpose! That's what they all say! No! <laughs> That's it. You missed! The trick is that they have to do it. You delegate the responsibility on the person, and it looks... Look at that presentation! You can't eat it! That's what they have the tomahawk for! <laughs> You guys focus too much on, oh, I gotta cut it. I was like, no, I'm gonna present it so they can Dude, cut it. mine smells like an old grocery store floor. Yours is not even edible, so yeah, you can take yours off the table. So okay, Michael. This is that type of restaurant I don't like. Oh! What a liar, you're so But I will you. say, because this is nicely prepped. No, stop. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh. Can you drink? Yeah, tastes like coconut. Eat the meat. I'm not gonna eat that, to be honest. <laughs> but I'll say Gun Gun wins this one. <laughs> It's terrible. <laughs> My first open up challenge, I won. Guys, vote in the poll if you agree or not, up above. Mine, Gunners, or Matt's, but if you pick anybody other than me, you're an absolute. So as we were buying this uh, apocalyptic crate, we came up with a pretty hilarious idea for another video. And we wanna know if you guys are into it. So this is a like to buy. We got a sushi Ferris wheel roller coaster. <gasps> is that a pun? Dude, I'm not even sure how it works. You know how I want it to work? People put sushi in it and then it takes like a little cart and then it goes down. Is that yeah. how it works? Does it go into your mouth? I don't even like sushi. Can I put mini donuts on mine? No, but it takes the pun away. Sushi roller coaster. Oh, donut, donut hole. Roller coaster. <laughs> <laughs> so this got us wondering what other crazy food gadgets people are using overseas that help them eat with a more uh, sunshine disposition. <laughs> <laughs> what media have you taken in to make those the first two words that come out of your mouth? I couldn't figure out. Disposition. <laughs> if you guys want to see that video, 10 food gadgets that you won't find in America, click like on this video. Our goal is, what is it, Michael? 90K. What? 90K. 90K likes, and we'll make an entire video on the craziest food gadgets, and we'll eat food with them, just like our mothers warned us against. Comment down below, roller coaster. Comment down below, donut holler coaster. <laughs> Next product. All right, what do I got? I'm gonna go with this. 
You would. <laughs> you know, I'm, it fits like the aesthetic. Yeah, I was say, yeah. that dress? <laughs> yeah, real dark and evil going on yeah. over there. You know, it's like uh, the evil Indiana Jones. You know, Kylo Ren mixed with Indiana Jones. You ever used a whip before? <laughs> Can't say I have. Have you? I have. These things scare the heck out of me. I've been able Ooh. to crack it before, but they scare the heck out of me, you know? Looks like a snake. That's why it does it. look like a snake. <laughs> I've seen this team. Video. Stop! You can almost hear it. Yeah, I can almost feel it. You're about to have you ever face. cracked a whip? It's exhilarating. It's like you have move. Chanel? Yeah. That was unexpected. <laughs> why? I don't know. What no, stereotype why? did you put on Chanel to where she not can't crack a whip? Not many people. It's not a stereotype. It's just surprising. You want to see me crack the whip, dude? Michael taught me how to crack the whip. It's He's like this. about to whip. <laughs> 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 this product right here, I'm not sure if I'm gonna have much success with this and I wanna be wearing some protective stuff, but uh, let's try it. I'm extremely worried about this one. <laughs> Why, you've tons of practice. I've done it once, I feel like, in my entire life. That's tons of practice. That's tons of practice, <laughs> enough practice, right? Yeah. yeah. Dave showed me how to do it for 20 seconds. <laughs> so I'm gonna try to destroy this balloon with this whip. So everyone, watch out! That was good! Ooh. Going right by my ear. Jeez, I get way too scared. You want me to try? Just no. take, it, take it slow. Whoa! I did it! I just had to relax. I just had to relax. That was good. I want to see if I can do it in less tries. Do it slow. Don't bend your arm until. Yeah. Yeah. It's like that, but just more of a flick. Yeah, you've got it. Oh, I'm ready. <laughs> Alright. Fight! Alright, that's dumb. Oh, you hit it. Dang, this is tough. You did really good. This is the one. That's not like the one. That's it, it's broken. Good. I've got a lot of practice from watching them. <laughs> Just take it slower than you think. Aim higher. Let it go farther back. Higher. higher. Literally look, look two feet higher and aim I'm trying, I'm trying. This is powerful feeling. I say dope. I say dope. I say dope too. Now here we go, guys. I have something super special for you guys. You've never seen these before. What Guess what it is? Guess what it is? Guess what it is? Long. Yep. You turn. Big. Also, yep. It is ninja sword. Wow. Chad. Chad. I was gonna say the same thing. Whoa. These are actually really cool looking. Oh, this makes me really uncomfortable, dude. I'm scared of you now. Yeah. Okay. So I've never been scared of you before, but now I am. I'm gonna treat it more of like a cut and a pierce, but I know that certain swords have different things. Oh, can I try? <laughs> All right. No, that's my carrot. Uh, Look how clean that cut, though. Cut very yeah. clean. Barely even did. I was just like, what I personally want to try with these is what Michael just said. I want to recreate Fruit Ninja IRL. So let's do it! Bring me the ninja swords. I'm prepared. Now, what I like to do with these ninja swords is reveal them no, to the public. Careful. This guy doesn't know what he's doing. Look at that. Looks like a butter knife. How are you doing over there? There's a splinter in my glove. There's a snake in my boot. <laughs> See, what if my friends are hanging by their feet and I have to cut off the string? No. <laughs> That. <laughs> and that's your turn. <laughs> I'm in the apocalypse and there's fruit falling from the sky and I need to make it as easily to eat as possible. <laughs> oh, oh, one oh. swing. And that's edible now. Look at that. Dude, look at that clean slice. Yeah, that's pretty sick. That's that's dope. Dope. So check this out. It calls for celebratory candy. Am I the only one that wants to try what a plantain tastes like? I'm gonna save most of the later. Plantain? Have you ever had a plantain? I was gonna try it ever. They're really starchy. It's like a potato mixed with a banana. It's a dope. <laughs> Grow up. <laughs> no. All right, my turn? Yeah, hopefully you have something to cut the next piece of my carrot. Oh, I'd love to. Oh, boy. This ain't gonna cut your carrot, but might do something else to it. What the heck is that? How'd you do that to the box? It's cool. Oh, no. It's like a Hydra version of a ball and chain. I kind of want to just swing this at you with, with this. That would still hurt. Yo, what if we have three mini Miley Cyruses on these? <laughs> and she's just swinging. Just Photoshop them on there. Yeah, Robert, Photoshop Miley Cyrus on these. Sorry, do what you can. It's gonna take him like an hour. <laughs> Robert, don't do that if you're tired right now. <laughs> Please do it. <laughs> These look cool, dude. Whoa. How heavy are they? Look at that. That'll do some damage. What do you do with this, Gunner? Someone comes up behind, don't even gotta look. You just swing it around. <laughs> it's a one in three chance of hitting yourself <laughs> yeah. in the back. <laughs> the goal is I'm gonna hit zombies coming towards me with these things. You better wear a helmet. A what? A helmet. You ever heard of one? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, <Yeah>. what? <laughs> That's not in the English language. <laughs> okay, so here's the thing. What, 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 
what, what is it again? I forget. It's a mal, a mal, mace. Oh yeah, it's a mace. Mal. Look at that mace, dude. These are way too mace. heavy, I feel. Yeah, this one's gonna be tough to not get hit by. Okay, just swing wide and swing okay. low. Okay. Sweet chair. <laughs> you look like a chef. You look like you're cooking up destruction. <laughs> It got, oh, what? Dude, that's dangerous. Dude, got you it. took out his knee though, and it, it got all bloody. Yeah, it didn't last very long though. What the heck? That's not strong. Wow, look at that. All. Okay, that's a that's a nope. Immediate nope. Immediate nope, dude. Dang. Look at that crouching zombie. Oh. Dude, that was heavy. <laughs> oh! So oh. Guys, this just in. We're doing a fan product episode where you guys decide all the products that'll be in that video. I am getting more. Tweet your product ideas at our Twitter using hashtag dope fan products and we'll release some polls on YouTube. All of you will decide the top 10 winners. All right, my turn. <laughs> <laughs> he just gets up from the desk. All right, this is the first one that we saw. It's a cookie. It's, it's a cookie. the workhorse machete. Do these people understand the irony of putting a knife in a package like this? No, they don't. I need the knife to open it. I think the scissors is the most yeah. underrated weapon. We tell kids not to run with them, but what if they did? Ponder on that for that a minute. Oh, come on. <laughs> this is just the sheath. It's an invisible sword. <laughs> Oh gosh, that scared me. It's actually really not sharp at all. I think it's more just blunt. Wow, this is this is really dull. It's also made to cut uh, trees. Yeah, so maybe it's just more durable than it is sharp. See, it's like a really bad cut. Yeah, that's really not good. Not Martha Stewart recommended. All right, let's try it. All right, so I have the kukri here, and as you can see right here, we got uh, some uh, flying zom bat zombies. Zombags. Zombags. <laughs> no, zombat. What is this filled with? Sawdust. You didn't attack it. I got people dead. all around me. All right, watch out, guys. That doesn't do anything. <laughs> this isn't that sharp though. I gotta do one hand though. Oh, oh it's spinning! Just go oh, hand. Right. Go hand. I like this. Okay. Oh, <laughs> even that blows my mind. There we go. It's spinning like I love. Dude, why is that so satisfying? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I didn't know I was in the wet zone. <laughs> Yes! Ow, my hair! Dude, like, it's so pretty. Oh, that's fun. I'll rate that one a dope. All right, uh, here we oh. go. What is that? What is that? It's a grappling hook. Oh! I have to grapple. You have to make it. I have to build? This is a DIY video? I can't even grapple this idea. Ah, oh, dude, tell me about it. But it's got me hooked, I'll tell you that. <laughs> All right, well, it doesn't come with instructions, so that's sick. Yeah, you're screwed. There's three pieces. No instructions? <laughs> Looks like you're screwed. <laughs> <laughs> So I take this rope. What is it, a spring? Yeah. Spring loaded, brother. Wrong way. Yeah. <laughs> like, what? I don't know what a grappling hook looks like. Really? I You've don't. never played Batman. It goes like this. Oh, yeah! You're right. I have zero real world experience with a grappling hook, but I didn't make that mistake. I don't, I don't remember that being called a grappling hook, but it's because I'm it's, dumb. What are you doing? You, you have to ever, screw it in, brother. Yeah, but you can't screw it in an angle, dude. <laughs> He's, trying to go to, he's the guy that strips the screws. This one's not even it's threaded. It's not threaded, it bruh. Threaded. Yeah, bruh. It's not my fault. No, you both are totally doing it wrong right now. Yeah. I am not. Oh yeah, just... no, you're right. It does go that way. <laughs> all right. It's done. This has to be safe. So yeah, all you do is grapple up the side, throw it up. You got that loose. What are you doing? Tip. We're getting ready to go test this, dude. Oh, you're done? <laughs> yeah, dude, first, first <laughs> try. Like 30 minutes. I did not. I did all of it too. Gunner didn't even touch it. I resorted to getting work done on my phone. You just ordered food. Hey, that's work. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like work. Let's go do it. All right, we have the grapple. The goal here is to grapple something. I'm not sure what you're gonna actually. Try. I'll grapple that. I wouldn't try to grapple that. I would. This is gonna fall on someone's head. Well, no, you point? throw from here. It's not gonna hurt anybody. It'll hurt you. Look at these spikes. I'll throw it. I don't know. Okay, so everyone has to. Everyone, everyone get back. Get and back. I know how you're supposed to do it, right? Yep. You're actually not supposed to hold it by the thing. You're supposed to grab it by the rope and let the momentum swing it up. See, you already sucked. <laughs> is that the Joker behind me? This is pretty cool. I wouldn't climb up that if I were you. I'm not going to repel it, but I, I don't do it. I'm gonna let it sit. 
<laughs> we'll remove it in a second. I will say that it surprisingly worked well, so I'm gonna give it a dope. Um, I don't think it's made out of great materials, but I think it's gonna be a dope for what we have. Yeah, so it's pretty cool, so I'll say dope. All right, I'm getting this thing because it's obscene. Indian War Club. A semicolon. Made of virtually unbreakable polypropylene. 24 um, inches overall. It's made to break concrete. You're supposed to break concrete with it? You can break concrete with that. No way. Let's go outside to the sidewalk. <laughs> What is this? Hello? <laughs> oh, that'll- Dude. Hello? That would put a hole in your head. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it would, in the best way. What's a good way to put a hole it in did. your head? It did! Is there a hole there? No, it's still pretty clogged. <laughs> <laughs> Tanner, can you do a quick search of what this is? Many sources have claimed that indigenous tribes created the design based on European firearms. The tribes who encounter the British, French, and colonial soldiers were impressed by their usage of a musket that, once its shot was spent, could easily be reversed, held by the metal barrel and used as a harrowing blood weapon in close quarters combat. Interesting. Oh, that's steel. That's steel. Steel what? That's not plastic. Like this is polypropylene or whatever it's called. Polypropylene. This is steel. How's it attached though? That's the thing. Oh, see, it's gonna break off. You think so? I think so. Okay, so here's what I want to do. I want to see if this thing can just puncture the head and not crush it. So Why I'm, would you want to do that? Just so I can, you know, put stuff in it. <laughs> <laughs> is that what you're planning to do with zombie carcasses? You know, put a quarter in, you know? That would hurt. All right, we'll see if you can do it. Look, I'm gonna try it on a melon. This is the weapon I have most faith in. For sure. I have a lot of faith in this. Ready? Just a hole, that's it. Nope. <laughs> that sound! Did that shoot juice? <laughs> yes, it did. Dude, that's perfect. Did you hear that sound? Oh, Dude, no. check this out. All you gotta do now is pour a sweet drink. Now, heads up! Oh. Ah! I know, I don't want to splatter myself. <laughs> nice. That one's gonna spray all over me. One, two, three. <laughs> That still got me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, over. No! I personally rate this a nope because I don't like that there's a screw at the end. It ruins the whole bit for Dude, me. I like yeah, it. I right say here. it's dope because it's got a lot of weight behind it. What do you say? Uh, I don't like watermelon juice on me, Same. so dope. Before the next product, everybody, I have an exciting announcement to make. We, Dope or Nope, have teamed up with YouTube memberships to ensure that you guys can have a bigger role in our content. We want to make sure that you guys have a voice, and you guys do, so let's make it be heard. You guys will get access to a bunch of secret Q&As, polls, live streams, behind the scenes, and like so, so much more. So if you guys want to see a bunch of what goes on in Dope and Up, you'll get to see it here. We are excited to begin this different, new, exciting journey. So if you want to learn more about it and go on a wild ride with us, your crew of life and love, hit that join button down below to learn more about it and we will ride along together. Ain't that right? Hop on my ride Harley. Ride or die! Hey, hop on my Harley, hop on my Harley, we're going. <laughs> Next product. Whoa, what is that? It's a hammer. <laughs> Puts it right back. <laughs> I just like axes, what can I say? Chop this. Wait, see if you can not crush it and just chop it in half because Tanner and I, you know what I mean? So this is like the baby and Tanner and I are fighting over it. So you have to like divide it to who deserves it most. We're divorcing and we would like to have each have some. Equal. Wait! He can have it. I want the weekends. He can have it. It means more to him than it does to me. Equal custody! Wait. But that's not what you're supposed to <laughs> You're supposed to give it to me. Who wants this baby? I'll, I'll, I'll take half. I won't because I want it more than him. That's a pretty clean cut. Yeah, that's pretty that good. That's not bad. All right, let's go test it. Looks like an ordinary hatchet from Home Depot. But good news, it's from El Salvador. Oh, it's special. You it's my favorite European country. country. Just like you. I'm not from El Salvador. My no, I just, I was saying you're special. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna try and cut these uh, pineapples straight in half. Oh! Now let's try the other side, because it's completely different. <laughs> Dude, great right in half, look at that! Dude, this is how much canceled. I didn't like Spongebob. I haven't made a single Spongebob meme this whole video, and I just did. Dang it. I say that's a dope. I say it's a no. Yeah. Too basic. It's an axe, nothing special. Thank you guys for joining us today, especially you, Barbara and Ethan. I love you guys oh. so much, and if you guys had a laugh with someone else today, make sure you guys carry that over to one of these two videos. Yes. This one is the apocalyptic video that Wreck did with Michael. Yes. Tell me about it. Yeah. Two sentences. We used fruit and destroyed it. <laughs> that was one, we'll take it. Also, <laughs> check out this one. That is a video that YouTube recommends just for you. I can't wait to see you over there, and if you don't go over there, I will literally cry myself to sleep. I'm gonna cry, goodbye. Yeah. Still here? Now goodbye. <laughs>